list. Uh, gotta just. I can hear you. Starting like reloading. I oh. can. Oh, not everyone's. Master Mas Supio's still there. Yeah, I, I keep having to refresh the stream when it does that. It's the second time that's happened. I'm wondering what's going on. I think it's Twitch. I know it can't be Twitch. Yeah. Oh, thank you, muted. Has it crashed on your has it crashed on your end? Uh, my my whole PC end? just crashed. Like, boop. First time it's ever done it, yes. actually. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, I, I was making a joke there about. Never mind. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Give me one second. I just got to get everybody's reactives back in here. Let me do Madam's first. Uh, Kirkman, can you post your reactive in the group chat? And I'll get you back in as well. Oh, yep. Yeah. Give me a second. There we go. Mm -hmm. Why is Madam a block of cheese or something? And you'll be... <laughs> Are you cheese tofu? Is this cheese for Resident Evil? Are you tofu? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Tofu? Oh, my yeah. God. That's amazing. <laughs> I, I, the intrusive thought. Hey, came I forfeit my like, fine goes to shark sashimi, sashimi, please. <laughs> just okay. Tofu. Just come back as tofu. No, you can get in two shark sashimi if you want. Give me one second. I just got to get Gurkman in here as well. Oh. I'll get you in two. Uh, let's see. Uh, uh, by, the, by the way, tofu run in two is like fucking hard in either version. OG or, or remake. Oh, hi, Freya. There we go. Yeah. Actually, I, I actually knew like Freya before I knew like you guys. Really? Like before? Huh. I, yeah. Oh. They were just in a random server I was on, and like before I didn't know they. I think I think I knew they. There we streamed, go. But we, you know. All right. Let me invite Shark Shishimi to the group too, as well. Oh, I'm Tinsy now. I can. Well, I think they were talking about the. Uh... <coughs> Front row seating, but yeah. Oh, oh, the, okay. I thought Spray wanted to get in on the call, Though which I was wanted, totally could do that too. Yeah, jump in. Mm -hmm. There we go. All right, back to the Lego building. So yeah, I don't know what happened. Off. I don't know why it crashed. Uh, it's actually the first time my PC's ever done that since I had a new PC. That was very weird. I blame mental. Yeah. I, yeah. I, I, yes. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, oh, sure. Really Let me add you in here. Oop. There we go. Post your video link and I will get you in the chat as well. Gamers. 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 What about them? You have my video. I need a new one. I need I need the link again. D yeah, did you expect to remember? Well, it's it not that I remember. It's that, it's, it's that I've had a ton of guests between now and then. And I maintain five mm. guest spots because I have five guest buttons on my fucking stream deck. So like it's been it's been it's been overwritten. Now, George, you should feel special because you are the only one who has a permanent guest spot that I've named BSK that will not be overwritten. <laughs> well, that's special, that's, man. That's that's lovely and probably a mistake in the long term. <laughs> Gurkman's drowning in a hot tub. It happens. Um, yeah, people I'll just live. drown. It just hold happens. Your yeah, hold your I breath, Gurkman. We'll get you out. <laughs> You're one of these, but there we go. Number three. There we go. There we go. Just above water now. Uh, somebody mentioned uh, knowing me from another server. Yeah, Kirkman. Before, which, which, yeah, right. It's you. Wait, it's I, you, it's the me. Kirkman. Uh, is that is ages? the wrong link, Shark Shishimi. I, I, I don't know why. I did not. Oh, uh, I mean, just just change the push to view. There you, okay, just change push to view. All right. I can fix it on yeah. my end. Now it's the correct one. <laughs> I mean, I think the reason why you probably didn't recognize it was me is because I, I was under a different, like, name thingy. I Don't remember fix. your current name, though. Okay. Oh, no, I like I, I've at least seen it, probably in my Steam friends list or something. Well, I mean, I came, I came into your, um, I came into one of your streams and said hi, and and you were like, oh yeah, so. Yeah. Right. 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 Yeah. 
I'm sorry, my memory is terrible. That's all right. <laughs> I just remember. I remember coming into your stream because I was like commenting on how lovely your accent is. Yeah. I heard that as rack. I, how lovely your rack is. <laughs> it actually, it, to me, it sounded also like true. Where's, where's yours? Like, like a, a cross between rack and accent, which is there we go. a concept I'm not okay. sure I understand. Fully. I think we've got yeah. everybody <laughs> all set. The, the concept of a rack <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. yeah I mean, racks are different all around the world. You, you know, different rack scents, different regions have different racks. Yes. Uh, yeah, but very true. I okay. Care Where's to explore explore my Appalachian peaks? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're all going to jail for that one. Or possibly hell. Yep. Yep. So yep. maybe hell. Maybe hell jail. We, we are. I mean, we're here, so we're already in hell. So they put the telephone in jail. <laughs> I, I think I'm chewing I, on the wires, I, I have... trying to escape. I have a tiny baby cat yelling at me from the other side of the apartment. I'm a child. Uh, no, B, he's not B. tiny. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's misleading. He's kind of large. Here we My go. Cats are. So I am linking the TechVox website for everyone because it's really cool. Link it in, yeah? in the in the in the in the stream chat. This is where I'm going to be getting a. If you go down to products up at the top and then Tech block, blocks. I'm going to be, right. uh, they have all sorts of really cool sex sets at our local <laughs> Menard <laughs> sex. Well, they have all sorts local of cool sex. Ooh. The best sex in the world. At our local Menards, <laughs> they have uh, the farming set and the A10 Thunder, th uh, the A10, um, what is it called again? Warthog? Yeah, A10. Ah. Which, um, you know, the, um, the, uh, was it the Gao Eight minigun yeah. on it? Yeah. Um. That is that specifically only that one part is produced by General Electric. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to show on the on the Discord or not on Discord in the in the on, in stream. Here are some of the things that they have. One of them that I think you'll really oh, like. Dinosaur one. They have these two. Oh, look at the this remote makes... controlled RC Lego cars. Oh, they're so, real too. So... Whoa. So here's all the pieces. You get the frame and the base, and you build the car around it. So you can build whatever you want and yeah. make it radio controlled. Oh, that's nice. And I think this is about twenty-five, thirty dollars. Oh that's my god, quite cheap for what that is. That Pank. exactly. Yes. Are you... And and this is the one I want to get. If I get, were to get one of the radio controlled dinosaur. ones, they do. I'll show you the dinosaurs in a second, three, chat. Three no, three separate dinosaur Funko Pops. Uh, I like this one because then I can build like don't, an off-road thing. Don't talk to me about Funko Pops. George has a really good Funko okay. Pop hey, quiz. Hey, George, Funko Pops? Oh God! No, I'm pretty I sure. Like I like I... so much research <laughs> on those fuckers. I have. No, I actually <laughs> have the, the 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 Overwatch Diva Funko Pop just because the mech was cool. Uh, yeah, I have one the, Funko the Pop because someone uh, gave it Funko to me as well, a gift. I say and I, I have couldn't that. Say please don't do that. I I, I I say I have that. My B has repeatedly knocked it out of the shelf and it's in pots now. George, look, a train. <laughs> yes, I see it. Train, George. I, I I I'm seeing it. I'm seeing it. Seeing if I can find that farm set I want to get. Here it is. Here's the farm set I want. This is only uh thirteen dollars. Just, just, so just just a small question. Mm -hmm. Uh, what the size of? Uh, so the size of the radio control car, mm -hmm. and the size of the train. Mm -hmm. Are they in any way similar? Uh, actually, the yes, they are. Smaller. Yeah. The train seems slightly smaller, only mm. slightly though. So I still feel like you could put the uh, the carriage on the uh, on the drive yeah, base. Yeah, could I put? Mm. And they do have sets that have tracks, like treads. Yeah. So like that would be how you do an off road train. Is you have you know tank treads. Off road train. <laughs> that's a thing train. they don't do. <laughs> Well, unless oh, you're, well, George, dangerous. that's not true. And what about the new Thomas the Tank Engine cartoons? Where Please the trains do not constantly... talk about that. What do you mean? The new Thomas the Tank Engine cartoons where the trains always go off the tracks and Please drive around down. Please don't talk what? about that. I like oh. this Jurassic Park set kind of thing that they have where it's like, 
you get the you get the expo exploration vehicle. It comes with a drone, and look at these raptors. Yeah, but mm -hmm. Pank, the thing is, what I mean, has happened to they... that le those things' legs? <laughs> I don't know, but, but clearly, right? Oh, I'm trying to remember the quote now, and I've forgotten they're it. They're just dinosaurs. Oh, yeah. They they spend so long. No, oh, oh what's the Asking famous it, quote? You know, whether or not they could, they never stop to think. You whether know, whether or not, or not they, they should. Whether or not they should. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. Uh, you, you've saved me from my terrible memory of, of like, quotes. Look at this little, look at this one. You get like a little drone, and you can build like this whole little set. Thank you for the read, uh, Liat, Lee, Lee, Leets. Welcome on in. Thank you very much for the raid. Welcome, welcome. We're building some Lego I today. To I still know how to read Leet speak. I love the dinosaur. I want this set just for the dinosaur. God, that dinosaur. misprinted eye is so ugly, but you know what? He's ugly in a cute way. It's Look a at him. dinosaur, it's a dinosaur. Wh why is it a dinosaur with a stump grinder? Death, don't question it. Cause that's a, that's a stump grinder right there. Yeah, no, <laughs> don't question it. I'm beating some Dinosaur Pokemon. has work to do. You got in just in time for us to build some more Lego. We're just exploring some tech box, which oh. is future Lego uh, uh, that I want to go. Yeah. Oh, you work in uh, you work in studio as well. Cool. Nice. Oh my god, I, I'm seeing some bio. Mental's stuff playing in, in studio there. right now. Yeah. Yeah, I am. Other what dinosaurs. Is oh, uh, is the Lego designer heavy. studio. Yeah. Oh, nice. So, do you remember um, Lego Digital Designer? No. Okay, well, it was okay. the official Lego, like, digital software. Buttercup Bandit. Dinosaurs hate stumps. It doesn't come up much, but it's <laughs> but true. It's true. <laughs> George, <laughs> actually, look at this train based on their hand sizes, which are clearly photoshopped in. Yeah, I mean, as you can is, tell. That is not, that is not <laughs> children. That isn't, yeah, like, these are clearly photoshopped in, but these are even remotely to scale. I think that that car wouldn't be too far off from it. It's a very cute little train. What do you mean by they're not human? They look human to me. I'm confused. Oh, they might be AI generated children. Oh no, the worst. Please, not the AI children. Or at least they're if they're not AI generated, they're at least super photoshopped. Oh my yeah, god! Look, look at the kid's thumb. Look at the kid's thumb in the yep, blue shirt. Yeah, right here. That's yeah, it, it, it ain't right. It's it a very right. bad photoshop, so, but I don't think it's AI. No, so yeah, this... like I would combine this one with it. That way, you could use that carriage for the train. In the end, there's only one good sort of AI, and that's the film by Spielberg. And then even that then, actually not wasn't too bad of a film. I like the AI film. It was. I like yeah, that it's one. Fine. It was a pretty cool movie, especially if if you know that like they also do a Rector at... sets they too. They took a stock photo of children playing with toys and with, sock like, uh, Steven Spielberg uh, uh, homage. Yeah, like, and they do Steven wood puzzles. Spielberg's... How much is long friend? So we do do, oh, do a bunch of different friend. ones, ah. but yeah. yeah so was, I plan to get was, some of these, some of this block tech stuff. Kubrick, yeah. Since this Lego building yeah, stream has gone pretty good, thing, but, uh... it's gone pretty, yeah. pretty good. Yeah, Kubrick gave it to him after he. Um, Speaking of Lego building, time, so... time to get back to it before he died. So. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah I yeah. should turn off the monitor so you guys can actually see the Lego. <laughs> yeah. There we go. All right. So we got this. I need to build this now. Which What's is your guys' favorite Spielberg film, though? Uh, um, Jurassic I... Park, probably. You'd pro you'd probably have to just list them, like like have a list of them that I would just go through Close later. Close Encounters like... of a Third Kind was underappreciated. Not bad. Oh, it was definitely that was uh, good. Indiana Jones and the Raiders of the Lost Ark and Temple of Doom were good. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, Last Crusade wait, was wait. nice. Like Last oh, Crusade's yeah. best one. Last yeah. Crusade's probably no, the best is. one. Yeah. I, hell, I was probably going to say that as my choice. <laughs> yeah, Last Crusade's probably my favorites. One. I mean, I just it's the the thing between Indy and his dad. That's my favorite. Yeah, one. that really does a nice mechanic. Oh, we named him after a dog. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, mine would either either have to be either uh, ET or Last Crusade. That goes up here. Wait, did Spielberg make E.T.? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't. I don't Honestly, I found E.T. pretty boring. 
Like I've I've rewatched ET, and I, it's okay. I'm not not mm-hmm. a huge fan of it, and I'm a big sci-fi person. I like sci-fi. Now the expanded universe ETs, mental. Do you know about those? Oh my god. Hank, are you going to give me another aneurysm? So in in the council chambers <laughs> room, like when Palpatine's giving his big speech, <laughs> and you see all the different worlds representatives on like the circle Hank, disc. Yeah. Hank, no, species, I know where yeah. you're going with this. No, there's no. ETs in there. There's species no. that are exactly that? ETs in there. ETs are uh, the ET that we see in the movie ET was a Jedi. Wait, is, is ET a Jedi? Yes, he used no, force powers. The stages of grief. He used Don't force powers throughout the entire movie. Uh, He's actually yeah, a sure. Jedi. Sure, why not? <laughs> sure, he can't, whatever. But they did not grant him the mantle. Re- I've got missed that. The up. mantle of Master. <laughs> Et Force Home. Et was um, was a badge, or was a, like a youngling Jedi. He wasn't very good at it. But he was still a he Jedi. He recognized the Yoda masks as Devil Summoner Marie. That's right. That's right. In the movie, he re- he freaked out at the Yoda mask. Y'all are reaching. How yes, fucked up would be if, if, if it have if, I mean, if it have been at the end of ET, the ship arrives and all the aliens on, aliens on it were fully clothed, and that means just ET was naked the whole movie. That's true. Yeah, you know, maybe it was a dick out kind of day, you know. <laughs> Well, I mean, the implication is that he's a kid, so maybe... Yeah, like he's a young one. species don't wear clothes, yeah. The this, this stages of grief, anger, hatred, arousal, acceptance, second arousal. Second arousal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure what piece I'm building here. Uh, well, that, so I, I just useful. I just gave my kitties some snacks and yeah, nice. some some yeah some freeze dried chicken Ooh. and uh, I th- they both got two pieces each mm-hmm. and did some tricks for them and I think Iba inhaled her second one so fast that she didn't <laughs> realize that she ate it because she I kept looking for it bit into my fingers and tried to get it from me after inhaling. <laughs> Well, I yeah. think I'll eat when it you say now. They did tricks, what sort of tricks did they do? Um, they sat and they spun. Like, oh, spin. You can get a cat to sit and spin. Spin. Yeah. You just need I the right that... motivation. Which is usually well, I mean, food. Most... It's always food. It's always food, yeah. but it's the same for dogs. I thought you couldn't train cats. Oh, you absolutely can. Cats are just oh, harder to train, but you totally yeah. can. That they are more temperamental, and it's less likely that you'll find a treat that motivates them well enough. One of the one of the key tools I'm told with training cats is obviously treats and a clicker. Clickers mm-hmm. are really Although good. I'm I I haven't used a clicker on them even once. You should try using yeah, a clicker because they'll start associating the click. Associate it. Yeah. Yeah. I I I know like why clickers are used. I've used clickers to train chickens. I've used clickers to train horses. You, you cha- wait, wait. wait, you click into your I... chickens? Yes. <laughs> The clickening for chickens. The I didn't know you could train chick. What what can you train chickens to do? Uh, Apart from like going like uh, going spots on the command and stuff. Okay, so not not get fired out of a cannon like in Chicken Room. Not get fired. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> it's, um, it's we actually we actually trained one chicken to play a toy piano by pecking at the keys. Oh, that's, oh, that's cute. Adorable. It's so weird because I watched Chicken Horn earlier today. Did you? That Which was one? Oh, oh, the first one. one. Oh, oh, the good. eyeballs. The okay. The one, yeah. Uh, yeah, like... Apparently oh, the God, I forgot there's like, another one. Tsuchinoko Mion says uh, you can train anything. You can train goldfish and better fish. Yeah. That, Mion says an thing. expert dog trainer. You you can <laughs> just kind of is, train yes. most animals. You know the usual click or training for chickens, sheep, cat girls, and it's puppy just, girls. You know, for to dogs, what degree cats, you the can usual. train them? I bet. What what are you meowing for? At least to like a master's <laughs> degree, at least. Bad joke. Teach me a moment. Teach my dog. Oh, studs. Okay, studs. Teach my dog how to weld. Ah, welcome on in, Raiders. 
Welcome, my new readers. My name is Hank. I'm a little pink squid on the internet. I've got so many guests with me today. Why I build a Lego Tauntaun. I've got Shark Shishimi, the Gurkman, Mental Marsupial, Giant Space George King, Bad Space King, and uh, Madam Universe, which is the tofu block on top of Bad Space King. Welcome on in, Raiders! We're building a Lego Tauntaun and just chit chat and just shooting the shit. What did you You'll play today, it. Demi? I wasn't expecting you to stream today. What did you play? What were you playing, I'm... buddy? You'll get it right eventually, Pank. Bad You've Space only known King. Me for two Bad years. <laughs> long. That long. Uh, there he is. There's the Demi clip. In the pit of her stomach was I mean, um, were you doing Alan Wake again? She was hungry. I gotta say, I might, Ooh, I, I might be leaving like somewhat soon. Uh, <laughs> the, 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 it, it, it depends. I'm waiting for a friend to, mm -hmm. who is having her internet installed, and then we're gonna stream the new Pokemon DLC. Ah, nice. So this is as far as we've gotten with the Tauntaun. We've got the torso and the tail, and I think we're working on the head right now. The Tauntaun head. Oh yeah, we got that. We got that. It's got the little ears. And right now, I'm looking for studs uh, to put in for this piece. I'm right here. Are you going you know, to? Are you going to you hide know. inside of the belly of the? You know, I, I, I don't I think that. I don't think that that the joke. little guy that they gave me will fit inside him. Darn. We built a you know, Lego I... at at a little at at earlier. A little little guy. Danny, did you know that the guns shoot now? That the Lego guns actually shoot. They've got a little like a, a little thing and you can like store. they shoot. I don't want to shoot it too hard because I will lose that tiny stud. Oh, it shoots the stud. Yeah, like I was I wish thinking they had it this when I was a little light bit, like, in it to make the Ew. stud light up. No, but it, sh no, it shoots no, they, the stud they now. Stopped, they, they did that for a while and they stopped doing it because it was kind of nightmarish to do all the wiring. So like boom, shoots them. Fair enough. They shoot the studs now, Demi. I think it was a thing where um, it was like the Jedi characters, the right arm oh. with the lightsaber and the torso and the head were all one assembly. And uh, if you press down on their head, it would connect a circuit with a little like, watch battery in their torso, which, of course, would eventually burn out and then yeah. you're screwed. But um, you would push down their heads and it would light up a little LED inside the lightsaber hilt and make the whole thing light up. Okay. Yeah, so there you go, people. <laughs> Never have a bad I, I hope all, so. Enjoy being first Shark Shishimi Zo in Madam Universe. Ah. Why did I make those so ah. sharp? The tofu strikes. There we go. Ah. So we got the little head going. So now I got push. How, how, why was the damage. use of all three times? Uh, because the That's, real first always... is the front row seating. Always has been. Ah, fair uh, enough. Friends we made along the way. Was always the front row seating. Hey, I'm gonna do this too. Cause why not? <laughs> Lucky egg. Egg. Mm. Oh, is that mm. one good? Oh, Thanks. good. Snuffflex was in chat. <laughs> <laughs> evil. It was quite nice. Yeah, Someone I was... am evil. Oh, Are we gonna put it? Semi yeah, we gotta put in the horns. Semi evil. <laughs> yeah, only a bit evil. Just I think they gave me just, extra horns. Just enough evil. Just only evil make on the you weekend. watch someone eat a raw egg shell and all evil. Welcome on in more raiders. Vivi, my name is Pangolin, oh the pink squid on the internet. I've got all my friends here. We're building some Legos. I'm building a Lego Tauntaun. Earlier today, we built a Lego at. Uh, <laughs> stickers! Okay, uh, Esh, oh, that's a lot of that Monroe. is a lot of Monroe and Snickers. Esh, would you come out and load up Monroe's snack uh, snack tray for him? Uh, and Monroe will get a whole bunch of snacks. Thank you, Tentacle Panther. But yeah, welcome I'll on be... in, Raiders. Can I, I'll Mental, can you do a shout out for, oh, we Pokemon! already got it, perfect. Thank you, Ash. Wow, Silent Hill too. Oh, oh look at that, look at that good kitty. Good choice for game. Oh, 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 look at oh, that's that. a very oh. good kitty. Why did it skip to the middle of the video and freeze frame? <laughs> eating Dang. His toes, dude. I do <laughs> love me a good kitty. Ash is loading up Monroe's snack wheel right now, and we will put Monroe's snack wheel up there. And then afterwards, we'll just give Snickers some snacks by herself, some Snicker snacks. Well, well you guys will get to watch Monroe eat out of his snack wheel, which is actually a I dog toy, but he still loves it. <laughs> 
Yeah. I was going to say, it was funny when you just suddenly said Monroe and Snickers out of there. It was like, well, are they made out of Lego too? And I was like, if only. If only. only if only I had a Monroe and Snickers set. Lego cats. Okay, this is. Okay, I think that goes in like this. You wouldn't have to feed them. It's Lego so weird, Mitchell, fall... having like a soft Lego piece. <laughs> Lego piece falls off of them and they eat it. Oh, yeah. That, where it's just rubber. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like, this is a weird for Lego. Yeah, those are rubber pieces that no, they've I don't had like it. since like they've had those since like what two thousand six. Yeah, I don't like. Sorry, it. no, sorry. Oh, definitely earlier. Not, not, not twenty sixteen. It was there. Two thousand eight, I think that specific piece was made for like horse reins. There we go. Wow. Ah, yeah. All right. Oh, there we go. Tauntaun reins. We have completed the head. The head is so finished. head. 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 Okay, I'm gonna turn on the Monroe okay, camera. Tauntaun. Torso. Yep, good. Oh, combo breaker. <laughs> and now you get to see Monroe uh, eat out of his snack those wheel. Knees and toes. Get out of my head. <laughs> Except when Buttercup and Nino's throwing the lucky egg up in front of Monroe. All right, so. Yeah, now What's we're Monroe gonna... eat an egg? Like uh, an oh, absolutely. Like egg with shell, oh, absolutely. With shell no, on it. No. Well, he'd eat, he'd eat, if you like crushed it up, yes. No Monroe censorship. Oh. Free Monroe. Uh, but no, Monroe and Snickers both like a uh, hard boiled egg. And and oh, just scrambled eggs. Of, they, they would. Yeah. Yeah. Any sort oh of protein. Oh, goodness. I, Bobby, you're so zoomy. Okay, that goes. They're flying back and forth. Yes, here. So I'm now... not sure who you were talking to there, but I'm guessing not us. She's talking. She, her, Shishimi's talking to B and Iva, her two kitties. Yeah. Oh, my her kitties. own cats, right? They, they, own they've cats, got. Yes, yeah. Yeah, they've they've got the zoomies. They're flying back and Aww. forth across the apartment right now. <laughs> right now. I miss my cat. So if we still have time, but I don't know if we will tonight. This is this was the I didn't expect these little ones to take so fucking long. But this is the next set that we're going to do on stream at some point in the future. Is a whole ass like X-wing. Oh hell yeah! And it also comes with all of these figures. Uh, that guy named Luke again, whoever he is. Princess Leia, <laughs> General Luke. Donna, Do uh, Do Donna, nerd, and uh, the famous R two D two. There we go. Yeah, the only one. So that's we famous. might not do this one tonight. Uh, we are sort of running low on time. But this will be time. its it, this will be its whole its whole own stream. <laughs> we'll put Leia in the pilot seat. Yeah, I don't know who that Luke guy is. We'll put Leia in there. Thank Hell you for yeah. the um, thank you for people in chat that gave me the hugs over the cat thing. Oh. I mean, it's it's yeah, it's it's tough. I mean, it's been over a year now, but you still miss them. I mean, I still miss my first pets. We lost um, a cat. Her name was Fluff, oh. and she was oh. exactly twenty years old. She died her birthday month. Oh. And we only knew Fluff for about seven years, but she was a twenty-year-old Methuselah cat. She oh was lovely God. and amazing. She was twenty years Not old. Many Not many yeah. cats live that long. Yeah. I, I yeah. And I, it was I one of those things her. where she was healthy up till the last day. At least she wasn't showing signs. She was old and lethargic because that's just how older mm -hmm. cats get. But she wasn't having any litter box problems or mobility issues or anything like that. And then one day she just sort of fell over and she couldn't stand back up on her own. We had to take her to the emergency vet. It was yeah. very sad. Mm. Yeah. I have to admit, I'm sadly, the way my cat went was... Well, it was quick, but it wasn't... Um, wasn't nice. Yeah, it never it is. It's way. not a. It's not a nice thing. It's just. That's it just not how it works it, out. No. It never is. Even if it's peaceful and quiet and silent, it's still sad because you lost a friend. What? And yeah. Yeah. people who like, so, like, oh, how? Why are you grieving over your cat? Like, buddy, my cats are like, like friends to me. Like they're they're companions. They're they're family. part of their family. They're yeah. part of my household. They are family. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Like I would run into my into my basement apartment if it was on fire to rescue my two cats. I would yeah. fucking run in here and save my cats. They're family. And then people who don't like animals at all, I don't generally trust them. People who yeah, are like, that's... oh, I hate pets. I hate animals. Like, you have what? underdeveloped empathy what? and you frighten what me. I don't people... want to be alone in a room with you. 
Like his, that <laughs> Monroe just refuses to solve the puzzles today, apparently. <laughs> He's trying his hardest. I remember my small doggo from growing up when he was just spending time cuddling up to me until one day he got visibly sick and we found out he was a rapid onset sickness. And yeah, I hope that he's resting well. Yeah, it's sad. Yeah. Yeah. I, uh, and Buttercup yeah, I, Bandito. I lost yeah. Zig a little while ago as well. Oh, you lost a cat too or a puppy? Cat. Oh. Mm. Luckily, I've never had a pet that like gets really sick before they pass it's always yeah. been very peaceful sudden oh monroe's uh a little more a little more cheerful nature monroe is really enjoying his snack wheel today <laughs> yeah ah. it's mu yeah that's much more cheerful than death yes yeah yes. <laughs> let's focus on Life that is definitely let's focus on monroe and his snack wheel yeah, so I didn't mean to be moved down. No, it's here's the thing. Talking about these things is how we remember our our pets and our friends and things like that. It is okay to talk about it because we're remembering them and we're thinking about not just the sad times but the good times. Like if like if you don't ever speak of somebody after they've passed or or, or a pet after they've passed, what was the point of even spending the time with them? Yeah, you know, it's it's okay to remember even if it makes you a little sad. It's okay and yeah. it's natural and it's good. Like, I wouldn't like if I would like people to remember me after I pass, you know, like, fuck. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure people will thank. Sometimes it's like, yeah. How the fuck no, does this piece go together? Gonna say them. So, you know. I'll, oh, that's the feet. Them. Oh, I'm making the foot. <laughs> There's the feet. Yeah. Okay. Sometimes when I've had a bad day, I I'm going to need two of those. Anyone's going to remember me, but. I, I try and ignore that sort of thinking because that's yeah, just, that's like... negative thinking, and you shouldn't engage or indulge it. <sighs> Correct. Uh, oh, apparently, Chat so Squid I'm, is mute I'm today. Just... Apparently, it wouldn't make you oh. so sad for them being it's gone because if the whole, they hadn't like, made you so network. happy while they were here. Of, uh... South Park yeah, said yeah. that, and I think it's before. very true. Oh, Ash, would you do me a favor and bring me over the medieval portrait of Fluff? That okay? So our friend Krakenoid, you know them as Skull and a Plinth. Uh, got mm -hmm. us a present, which features um, a picture of Fluff, and she was lovely and beautiful, and we always said that she was like the princess and the queen, and Esh is bringing me over the picture now. I'm going to show it as best I can in the camera. So it is a medieval-style portrait of Fluff. Oh, that's amazing. I love that. Aww. 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 <laughs> and we have this hanging up on our wall. We love it. And that's one it's very sweet. Cool. She had a little fairy saddle on her nose, a little little mark there. Yeah. And she was she was very pretty. Yeah. Just, I love I love this medieval portrait of her. We we have it hanging up. It is so good. And like I'll try to show you the rest of the body of it. It is your standard like Elizabethan style queen <laughs> with neck rough. <laughs> and so yeah, we have this hanging up and we love it. All right, I've got to put I've got to put the feet together. And Monroe has finished snacking. Ash, do you want to put some snacks up there for Snickers, or should I turn off the camera? <coughs> okay, Snickers is off doing her own thing, so I'm going to turn off that camera. Are, are so, those uh, boxes in the background of the snack cam snacks? Those are Tiki Cat cat food boxes. They were out of Tiki okay, Cat cat okay. food. By the way, exclamation point thrown. You can get them some more Tiki Cat. So Monroe and Snickers eat their dry food. They have a bowl of dry food that they can graze from at any time. They each mm -hmm. split a can of wet food in the morning and split a can of wet food at night. But it's your normal cat wet food. Just, you know, normal mm -hmm. wet food. They love Tiki Cat cat food. It is that is the one that I ate on stream during the subathon because when you open it, oh. it just smells like chicken soup, and it turns out it's actually just super bland. But the cats go completely crazy for it. They yeah, absolutely it, love Tiki Cat cat food. But the problem is Tiki Cat cat food is like two dollars a can. Oh, okay. That yeah, shit is expensive. Oh, excuse me, uh, Monroe uh. and Snickers get. 89 cent wet food, two cans a day. Half a can in the morning, half a can at night for each of them. Yeah, that's what my cats get to. They they also split <clears throat> some wet food. And then they have a grazing bowl just I like you. I had two big spoonfuls of Tiki Cat. <laughs> okay, Pank, I'm interested now mm -hmm. in the question. And that is, 
how did you name them? What gave them their name? Monroe and Snickers? Okay, so Monroe was a rescue from a shelter, and that was just the name he had. Now, we think yeah. we... Can somebody do uh, Throw Monroe or do Monroe and Snickers and have it pop up on screen? Like, can you do a Throw Monroe? Is See, he's got a little he's got a little black spot on the side of his cheek. Yeah. And like Marilyn Monroe, she had a mole, a beauty mark. Oh, she did, didn't she? Yeah. So we think that's why oh. they named him Monroe. Instead of Marilyn Monroe, Dirty just boy. Monroe, because he's a boy. Dirty, 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 Dirty. Now, Snickers, uh, Snickers, one night, Esh and I were coming home. It's like 12.30, 12.45 at night. And we're pulling into our driveway. And we're going inside. And like, Esh notices a cat. Like, sort of inching up and sneaking up to us and going... Meow. Now, she was super hungry. And she had come to us for, for help. Like, she was starving. Even though she had a bloated belly, it turned out she had worms. Oh, yeah. So I had Esh. I'm like, Esh, go inside, get some food. We're gonna, we're gonna get a cat. And like, we fed her and brought her in. We didn't take her inside because we didn't want her to infect any of the other cats until she'd been to the vet. And we, mm -hmm. we ended up feeding her. I mean, she ate so much because again, she had worms. She had a bloated belly, and we think that she was abandoned Thank because she is a very beautiful cat. Like, why would you ever? And she's got a notch in her ear, so which usually means that they, that they're astray. <laughs> and that they've been spayed, which it turns out that she has mm -hmm. been spayed. But we don't think that she was a very, like, we feel that she was an indoor cat that was abandoned and then captured and spayed. And that's ah. why she has a little notch in her ear. Oh, like they would have just released her after they spayed her? Yeah, that's what they do in cat colonies is they'll, they'll neuter the males or spay the females and release them back into the colonies. And then that mm. just takes up space. They don't breed. It's how you get rid of mosquitoes, too. It's like sterilizing all the mosquitoes. You put in a certain percentage yeah. and it just lowers their numbers. So we think that's what happened with Snickers, is that she was somebody's cat, and they abandoned her. And then, as a stray, they spayed her and released her again. And that's how we ended up with Snickers. And we ended up calling her Snickers because she's got, like, a candy-like coat. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, we consider naming him Milkshake, but he actually reacts to his name. So Monroe Milkshakes Von Chunkloader is his full name. <laughs> that is what is on his, like, little ID card for the vet. It's Monroe Von Mil Aww. Monroe Milkshake Von Chunkloader. And Snickers Why? is Snickers killed. Why not? Because it's like a chunk loader in Minecraft, because we played a lot of Minecraft at the time, and he's big enough to where he would oh. keep a chunk loaded. And so Snickers is Snickers Hildegard, Snickers Hildegard Von Chunkloader. Oh. <laughs> so, See, if I, if I were to get like a pet cat, I'll just name him Jackson. See, okay. cats either have names like Soup Dish or Jackson. Like, they're, they're, the cat names are wild. They're either like a normal person name or Soup Spoon. <laughs> so, I got a question now that just comes from that because my brain's done the silly thing of taking something that's not logical and trying to make it logical. Yeah, go ahead. And that is that, well, they've both got the same last name, but they're also adopted. Mm -hmm. Does that mean that both you and Eshi's last name is actually Von Chunkloader? Um, Yes. No. <laughs> oh, what a shame. Hank, that would've, Hank Raru Von Chunkloader. Hank Raru Von Chunkloader. No. I would I'm not that I'm not that lucky to have a Von Chunkloader name. Oh, well, you can change it to it. Darn. I could. I was gonna say, don't let your dreams be dreams. Alright, so Don't let your dreams be memes. Don't let your memes be dreams. <laughs> don't let you, your memes be real. Well, you've run out you've run out of things, <laughs> sorry. You, it's fine. Like, <laughs> All right, so there we go. All right, let me build a second one of these. Trying to build this on stream still. I thought your middle name was that. <laughs> it was that. Yes, the actual one purpose of the stream. On stream. <laughs> I thought your middle name was the. the. <laughs> Thanks, Miles. Thank the little pink squid. My middle name's the. Wouldn't be the first person. Pank Rauru is my full name. Pank is just my nickname. Wait, was that a Sonic reference, my aunt's dead? Yeah. Yes. It's, it's Sonic <laughs> Boom, the cartoon. Okay, Sonic Boom is it's possibly one of... Pank it's pronounced It's pronounced Pank Rauru, yep. Just Pank, just Pank is, is fine. fine. Uh, Sonic Boom is one of the best cartoon series made in the last five years. Hands down. If you have not... I still Boom... haven't seen it. I've seen the Sonic Boom, the game, is absolute trash. 
It's yeah. not worth playing. It's buggy. Oh, yeah, it's the bad. Horrific. The show <laughs> is a fucking wild trip. I have season one, and season two on DVD. Get the sassy thing knife. See, I, I love my favorite. I will thing show is it in the Discord at some point. Thing. I will show it. Which <laughs> is so the good. The soup is cold. Wait, it's, the soup is yeah. cold and the salad is hot. How is it even possible? Well, yeah, that was the one, cold. That was the exact <laughs> quote I was thinking of. Or was it was one time when um, Knuckles was was became super feminist or something? Oh yeah, he's <laughs> not in a bad way. Knuckles, Knuckles is a, a way. it's a confirmed feminist. Yeah, yeah. And, Where there was um, like. What was, what's, <laughs> Did he, um... he just feed it, this food to the baby we'll just put it in the blender okay <laughs> Puts, <laughs> carries baby to the blender okay what was that one? Oh, and of course the memes that came from him when big time he became the mayor oh yeah. yes with like the stamping pads the like where he's like stamping memes. things on the pads when he became the mayor yes, and, yeah and then he since then he became the uh the whole approve meme approver. Yes, the meme approver. Mm. The only thing they fear is your meme. Well, I just find it funny because it's like one of those ones that just came out of nowhere. It's like all those people there use it to like approve everything now. The same with anything to do with yep. like. Um, That's how meme work. You know, the poet. Mm-hmm. That's how meme work. I love Michael I, Rosen's poems. Uh... I was gonna say they don't. I don't think anyone like I don't know if Americans know who Michael Rosen is, apart from the fact that he's a guy that famous for going <laughs> nice. Oh well, yeah, with oh, the, the well, I originally yeah did learn about him through the YouTube poops, but then I actually started listening to his poems, and I'm like, yeah, no, he's wow. a really good poet. He's, he's awesome and the leftist. Yes. Mm. Did I build mm. these feet right? Or I mean, having seen some of the shit that he's seen, I would be surprised if he wasn't. That doesn't feel right. I feel like you built two of the same feet. What? I mean, did you mirror them? No. Thank you. Supposed why. to mirror them. It doesn't say that in the instructions. Did, wait. Well, okay. you don't want two left feet, <laughs> do you? <laughs> this Tauntaun might end up with two left feet. I'm going to say... That <laughs> means it can't dance. Can, yeah. <laughs> like, listen, uh... it doesn't say to mirror them. So if it can't dance, does that mean it's Phil Collins? I don't know who that is. <laughs> it, it's it's hey, the whole wait, of Genesis hey, in one. Wait, wait. Can you can you Hank, check the next page? Hank doesn't know who what Genesis. Oh, well, look, know who Phil we're Collins old. Is. Look, look. We're not we're that old. much older than them. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm only thirty three. I Come think on. it's about oh, to tell right, you. I am like, okay. Yeah, I am older. Um, oh yeah, it's gonna. Yeah, okay. It's okay. All right, all right. That's fair. That's fair. weird. Br yeah, like, okay, yeah, so I went, I, I caught COVID at a Genesis concert, so what? <laughs> hey, wait, seriously? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it was, okay, it was, so it one, was of the, like, one of the London shows a couple of, uh, a year or two ago. Yeah, I went I went to the one in, I went to the one in Birmingham, thankfully, never got, didn't actually catch anything. It's pretty mm, good, actually, yeah. apart from old man Phil being a bit, you know, he's old. Well, he can still, he can still sing, god damn. Yeah, but, uh, that's insane. So, so wait, it, their name is Genesis and Britain, but I thought if their name would be Mega Drive. Oh, Mega no. Drive. Oh, 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 oh no, is it time for a game? <laughs> Madam Universe, I have to send you to the void for a couple seconds for that one. No, uh, not the void. No, no. no okay, no. all right, all right. I'll, I'll, I'll forgive you this time. Oh, just the this one. Time. Just the one. Just the one. Then I'm done. Yeah. <laughs> It, it was incredibly delayed. I pressed that ages ago. <laughs> right, this is gonna go in. Damn it! There we go. Perfect. A little tauntaun leg. Mm, now we're gonna rebuild it on the fingers. other side. Can't paint this model correctly. Um, we get all these oh, pieces. Oh look! Mirrored leg instruction. <laughs> Uh, All right, here we go. All right, let's build the leggy. Okay. You so. fucked up. I sentence you to bean. Oh no! Ash, please, no more bean. <laughs> so, for those of you who don't know, when I fuck up, normally I would do squats on stream, which is where you see the little squat counter up up here, the squat counter like right over here. 
but I recently had COVID. I'm testing negative now. Like I've been negative for well over a week, but I am still mm. short of breath and coughing. So I can't do like my exercises uh, like long I normally COVID. do. So Yay. it's, I don't even think Ooh. it's long COVID. I just have an irritated throat. Like everything else is fine. I don't have fog, taste everything. No, nothing like that. It's just. I mean, there are degrees <coughs> to long yeah. COVID. Yeah. I just have a shortness of breath and uh, a cough when I go out into the cold air. So, so these are bean boozled. They're naughty and nice. They have a multitude of flavors, which I think they heavily, heavily favor the, the bad ones. Let me raise my ears so you guys can see. It would be more fun if it favored the bad ones. Come on, focus. You fucking. There's anyway, there's flavors like old bandage, dirty dishwater. Bean, there bean, is bean, bean, barf, bean, bean, peach, bean, bean. rotten egg, booger. I think the worst ones so far are, and ones that Ash loves, is liver and onions and old bandage. She she likes those flavors. Uh, she I can't likes even... old bandage. Liver and onions and liver and onions. IRL, so you know whatever. I don't like. Actually get I don't flavor, mind liver right? and onions to taste so much. It's the texture, like of actual liver and onions. The taste for these ones is vile to me. But uh, dirty <laughs> dishwater is the worst one so far for me. Uh, but the rest of them are not great either. Dead fish. Which I pointed out, and that uh, George has we pointed, out, pointed out. Ash pointed out that all fishes that you eat are generally dead. Stink Gen bug, so just I barf. Hope, I think they, I think they meant rotting fish, though. I'm guessing. Now toothpaste yeah, isn't bad. Meant rotting. Toothpaste but, uh... isn't bad. It legitimately tastes like toothpaste. Though I've spent my entire childhood and adult life teaching myself to not swallow toothpaste, so it's actually difficult to, to mm. chew up and swallow this bean. So I will now go and get a random bean and to show you I have been eating beans. There's not many left. I'm gonna have to get another box of bad beans. Oh hell yeah. Mal says they usually are dead except for that one time. <laughs> Alright, you know chat. Say. Uh white or orange, you pick. Actually, George, you uh, pick white or orange. Uh take orange. Okay. Orange is Enjoy going to be buff. <laughs> Actually, no, You. it's either going to be strawberry, banana, smoothie, or dead fish. Well, it might both be of barf. Those sound it might not be barf. Enjoy. It might be barf. We'll see. It's barf. Yay! <laughs> I'm a prophet! Which, incidentally, the barf. Tastes like spoiled ravioli with yeah. sauce. It is suffer. It is. It is not great. Thanks, Myons. Thanks. <laughs> and hey, Goblin Hugger, can I get a shout out for Goblin Hugger in chat too? Uh, can actually, mm -hmm. can we do a shout out for everyone here? Goblin Hugger, George, oh, Mental Marsupial, Kirkman, and Shark Shishimi. We're just gonna do five in a row. I assemble foot. Let's see what happens. Yeah, feet. Oh, he's yeah. perfect. Oh, he's perfect. <laughs> Gobsy Chad, built a, perfect. Gobsy built a, uh, a Lego perfect. mimic. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. What, what a lovely box. On it. What a lovely box. It's also another uh, bootleg box. Box. Lego. Amazing. <sighs> a bootleg Here's the thing. Here's the uh, thing. I, like, I, Nerf I is generally it. trash nowadays. While Lego <laughs> isn't trash, they're super expensive. Wow, and other companies wow, are taking the place of Nerf. It's a other nerf. companies are it's, taking the place of Lego. It's a problem. Yeah. Other companies are taking the place of Lego now. Because they're making better products at a much cheaper price that people can actually fucking afford. Uh, do George mm. next, please, Esh. And also Goblin Hunger. Bad Sp Goblin, it is Bad Goblin. Space King. Yes. Um, I need a single... Who's that Pokemon? I need a single thing. Uh, there it is. Oh, no. They, they, have, they have a problem. You know? Oh, it's... Br Oh, it's a that, it's that CA and George a, I'm getting uh, a bonus shout out accent. there. Yeah. Do I want to ask why there are bees there? I mean, it doesn't seem. You're uh, just eating no, all the bees I in the game. Uh, That's one of the goals is they eat all the bees. I do eat all the bees in Skyrim. Yes. Eating the bees? It disappeared. <laughs> and they yeah, are getting close to their beagle. Uh, yeah, it teleported away. All the bees. Hmm. We might be missing a piece. Know why? But he's eating all the bees. Hmm. 
Who's that Pokemon? There we go. Next one's metal. Oh, it's from the big uh uh, uh pathologic two stream. That's oh, got yeah. me, got a... mental, sussy, shock attack, goblin hugger, tabby, and uh, mental. Wow, they all look cool. All the models there. Yeah, mental made models for all of us. Oh my god, yeah. Wild. Pathologic. Oh, wow. uh, here's the piece I was figure out when we're gonna do that next. <laughs> if you Wait, mental made, mental made all that? Yeah, mental made all of them. All of them. <laughs> I can't forget how fucking talented you yeah, are. Yeah, mental right? is one of those streamers who's dangerous. Uh, because they are an artist Pokemon! streamer. Yeah. Oh, there's... That, like, I'm getting bonus clips all day. It's Recrix and Shark Sashimi playing the little slug cat game. That does look really fun. It's a really cute game. It's a very difficult game. Especially in co-op mode. Guys, please. Yeah. Um, it's like, please thank you, great. I think I might actually tear my fur out oh, if it's, we had it's, to play that it's together. The fucking, it's it's the jet fish drowning me, or at least trying hmm. to. <laughs> I think we might be missing a piece. I don't see where I've lost it. I don't see any piece on the floor. So our Tom Tom might be have a weird leg. Hmm? Okay. There's some special. Hmm. I'm missing that backward peg. Okay, it's supposed to be a gray one, another one on top of it with a with a back peg. And I don't see that in my parts bowls. Or in these pieces right here. Oh wait, nope, nope. We do actually have it. It was just it looked like it was a different piece because it had another piece attached to it. So we're good. We are good. Our Tauntaun is not going to have a weird leg. But in order to get that one out... <clears throat> there we go. Sorry you had to see that, Mental. Who's that Pokemon? Who's that Pokemon? Oh, separators. Be sure to check out the, the Gurkman at... Yep. Check out Gurkman, and when you, when you check out Gurkman, make a clip of their stream so we can see a clip in the future. Tofu yes. is Madam <laughs> Universe. Who's the Tofu? It's yes. Madam Universe is the Tofu. I, I, I'm the Tofu. Because you're playing Resident Evil 2 as the Tofu. Who's that Pokemon? Yeah. Hard, very hard mode. The... Tofu. Okay. Can't wait but for when Splatoon Batman gets a Tofu costume. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I got the Plague Doctor the mask original. one? I'm so happy with that. <laughs> this is when Batman sends someone to the void. I don't know if that's a room we can access to. I think huh? Batman oh, was... just sent that man to oh, the void. The okay. Uh, Batman banishing people into the void between be worlds. Cop <laughs> that game has some weird collision, and I love it. <laughs> Alright, there we go. We got the weird leggy, so we can now put on weird leggy. I love Weird Leggy. There you go. Weird Leggy is attacked. Oh, there we go. There's a, there's a Gurkman. Oh, I actually might have misspelled it. The Gurkman. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, don't... don't... Oh. oh, it actually clips something. Yeah, it works. Uh, okay. It doesn't look like it got misspelled. It looks like... No, no, I think my misfunction sometimes yeah, misfires. No, it just I think I, I, that wasn't what surprised me. It was the the clip thing that it actually. I love Gungeon. Such a good game. There we go. It is. Now we need a little. I still didn't complete everything in the far farewell to guns update. I I gotta actually get on playing all of that. So, Some of the stuff that I was able to get in Gungeon, I will never be able to do again. <laughs> that miracle moment sort of thing? Oh, absolutely. I think I just heard a cat throw up on the rug, so I'm going to uh -oh. be right back. <laughs> All right, we'll see you in a minute. Mm -hmm. There we go. We're good. We got most of our Tauntaun ready. And they look adorable. Yeah, look, look at those googly eyes. I like that. I like the googly eyes. Little con Tauntaun Google eyes. They look friend shaped. They are friend shaped. It gave me two sets of horns. 
I guess in case I lose a horn. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, it's they, ma- used to, they usually give you extras in packs like yeah. these. So macro binoc- binoculars are going to go in the up and down one on that side. So I've actually created an actual clip now. Ooh. Ooh. So send it to me yeah, in the I Discord. Yeah. And I can make it play with Sidekick in the stream. Nice. There we go. Let me just find the There we go. Anton's coming along pretty good. Not. <laughs> <laughs> Who's doing that? You, who do you think? We know yeah, who I, it is. I know. <laughs> gay, 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 Waiting for Vicar Kamen Link. <laughs> I'm a witch. Well, I didn't <laughs> find anything, so hopefully it's not that he threw up somewhere I didn't find it. He's making a little cat gag noises. It happens. So we got the yeah. macro binoculars on the side. Could be a hairball. It happens. And even then, though, there's... Th- okay, so... Okay, like, you want me to ride my Tauntaun around with a lightsaber that is just discharged and going. Yeah. Yeah, sure. What could happen? There we go. That poor that doesn't Tauntaun. sound like anything mm. awful could happen at all. That poor Tauntaun. Tauntauns yeah. are immune to lightsabers, don't you know? Yeah, nothing, nothing, nothing's ever half bad happened to a tauntaun. That's a tauntaun. That's oh, Ash says that's the tauntaun saber. <laughs> that that <the> saber belongs <laughs> to the tauntaun. So in Star Wars, in the West End games, Panda clearly doesn't understand light sources during tauntaun travel. Clearly not, Panda. Clearly not. So in a Star Wars RPG, tabletop RPG, uh, I was a droid which is pretty fun to play, and I wanted to use a lightsaber, because like the whole reason you can't use a lightsaber as a meat person is because you need to be Force-sensitive because the blade's weightless, and there's weird momentum, and like, well, I'm a droid. I can just program myself to use the fucking thing, right? And my DM was like a Jedi purist, like one of those people like, Jedi are the bestest, bestest things ever. So oh, I was gross. like, okay, I can't use... He wouldn't let me use a lightsaber. It's even, even a machine can't you know do the beauty of a lightsaber battle. So like what I did the, was the, I... Inst- the... I installed the See lightsaber into my three? chest. <laughs> I installed the lightsaber into my chest and ran up and hugged my enemies and activated the lightsaber internally. It would then Fantastic. just 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 stab them right through. So that's how just I ended up them. using the lightsaber. Was it was built yeah. into my chest. I grapple my enemies, activate the lightsaber. Just, there's no avoiding it. They didn't get a roll, and that GM was salty. <laughs> yeah, Ooh, yeah. If, well. if, you, if you if you're a dick. Then yeah. and also yeah, the hard way. Also yeah, General Grievous. What about him? Yeah, exactly. General Grievous. This was, this was before. This was before General Grievous. General Grievous is the droid either. <laughs> yeah, he is technically a living thing. He's just a yeah. very oh, cyborg, cyborg cyborg. Yeah. <sighs> Last time we played Star Wars RPG, one character was a droid that was just a sphere that would run people over. I remember that. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that sounds like a stupid. Yeah, it was. It was. They here's the thing. They really, really love Jedi, a lot, and so like Jedi were perfect and could do no wrong. When we all know that what Jedi actually are are of a set or of a Force power group, the Force power group that got state backed uh, monopoly on violence. They're basically cops. They're the secret police for the Empire. So remember, all Jedi are cops, and that means A J A B. All Jedi are bastards. Jedi are technically cops. Have you seen? Oh. Have you seen the thing of uh, the Mandalorian talking to like a uh, little kid with like an X-wing? Hey, Jab, what exactly. Sound the X- I love General what, Grievous. What, what is, sound does the X-wing Batman make? And Oink. Why the spot. And why? Because they're all cops. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah, we've we've built our two sets. Let me put our little guys together. 
And so they've got like a little thing so that they, they can actually ride them. Sit them on there. And they're going into battle together. Or against each other, I guess. They're holding hands. I, I feel like if this guy wasn't a Jedi, this guy would win this fight. Because this oh, no, thing has got... he wins the fight anyway. Because this thing's got, it's got turbo, four lasers. turbo lasers and a, and a hand laser. Whereas this guy has a Tauntaun with a charge-mounted lightsaber. And he does technically have a gun. He, do, he does have a gun as well. So this Luke guy doesn't have a lot going for him. The Tauntaun's got a lightsaber. He doesn't. <laughs> this Luke dude... Yeah, like if if it comes to it, the Tauntaun could like slice open Luke's belly and live in him. Yeah, if, if need be. <laughs> yeah, no, there we insane. go. Oh, and the tail wiggles, kind of, because it's on a ball joint. So the tail wiggles. So those are two Lego sets that uh, we built tonight. I I'm pretty happy with them. I like them. These we are all of our... Lego set. Technically, it's two in one, because, like, listen, it's two separate instruction books, booklets. <coughs> Fine. I will make them kiss, Ash. <coughs> and they're both boys. <coughs> okay, got the clip for you. Sorry it took so long. <laughs> there we go. All right, let me pop this in. And let me put it over here. Works, but... ah, there it goes. Now I have that clip. Hi, Fett. Hmm. and that at kissing. Mm. Mm, they're both boys. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> the head articulation. That actually is that is pretty cool. And the leggies are neat. Do a little dance. Hooray. Got the leggy. I guess it didn't have two left feet after all. That was the Tauntaun. We, we managed the mirror of a feet correctly with the instructions. Hooray. There we go. Yay. So, uh, we got a little bit of time left over. Do you want me to show you some other things around, like, my desk area? Sure. Yeah, sure. Here's an incredibly Actually, bright clean flashlight. Very, very soon. Ah, oh, my eye. So here, let me get these. So I like to make miners, miniatures and trains. I haven't done it in almost a year. <laughs> but I like to show these off. So first off, we'll get the bad, badly painted TARDIS out of the way. I did, the, did these with just craft paints. That's why it came out terrible. And bumpy. Yeah, it looks, it looks but fine. it is the correct scale for wargaming. So like there's a guy next to it right there. So it is it is close to the right scale. So when I would play war games of any kind, I'd always slip the TARDIS somewhere on the map. You know, at a corner, behind a building, in a junkyard. I'd, I'd slip the TARDIS in the map just because I like having it there. It was a nice little Doctor Who reference. This is the first miniature I ever painted. I did terrain before this, but this is the first miniature I ever painted, and I think it came out pretty good for a first try. Nice shading. Got my eyes. They're be they're just, you know, my eye dots are nice. A little floof. The metal on the bow. For a first try, I think that's pretty heckin' good on my skeleton. I think you're like the second person I know that paints miniatures yeah. like this, and I all and I'm always impressed. How, like I how, might even do it on stream on in the future. If you guys want to see a miniature painting stream, I do. Let me go grab it. I made this with Ruby. Made this Ruby the Lazy hey. Goblin. Let me grab it. There wow. Mental, did you say something? With Hero Forge, oh, no. hmm. they made a pink a pink miniature. Wow. Oh. It's a good pink miniature. It's, it comes on the That's little so base cool. with, with egg. Would you like egg. to put together my Lego DeLorean? <laughs> well, it has egg. <laughs> I might actually love to do that, Kane. That actually sounds really fun. Not tonight, but in the future for a future Lego stream. Let's see if I can get it to focus. It's got my brush with my knife in it. It's got my little tail. My little tail. And there we go. It's just little me. 
Bokeh should I be asking. I actually have to get going, but thank uh, you for having me, Pang. Oh, uh, Phantom, no worries. Thank you for being here, buddy. Ah, there it is. Now it's in focus. So I've got the correct color uh, for this, so I could actually paint this on stream. I've got the correct color. Took me a while to find it, but I got it. So there was my Bye. first miniature was a skeleton. Mental, you had a great night. Thank you very much for being here. I appreciate you being here for my Lego stream so much. You're a good friend. I appreciate you too. Aww. <laughs> this was the second miniature I painted, which was just like a Hulk ogre thing. And I thought I did really good with the dry brushing and the shading on him. And again, like, look at that teeth detail. I got the teeth in without fucking it up. Eyes. So this was the second one I ever painted. And again, I like that, you know, it's not just flat green. It's He's got shading and br dry brushing in him. Yeah, there's detail uh -huh. into it. So not too bad for, for a second try either. Um, This guy, I'm really proud of how he came out. And this was just following the instructions on the painting kit I got with Reaper uh, Minis. I got a little Reaper painting kit that taught me how to, like, kind of do these guys. I'm really happy with how the chainmail and stuff came out. And again, not too bad on the face and the eyes. Mm -hmm. And, like, the shading on his on his uh, loincloth, his boots, the leather, how it's a little bit shaded as well. It's not just completely flat in color. And again, I thought the chainmail came out really good. Yeah, that's good. Mm -hmm. He has a little sword. A little orc. Uh, this guy could have come out better. He was like a Terminator. Like, his face was really hard. And I was sick when I was doing it at the time. But I'm still happy that I got his shirt being a different color, his belt, and he, his pants are dry brushed. So, like, not the mm. worst. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I, I'm still happy with how this one came out. Uh, let's see. Oh, this guy, my dwarf, if I can get him out now. Come on, dwarf. Not even dwarf, just a, a fat old dude. <laughs> but I really like that I was able to get all the detail on his armor. Wait for it to, like, actually focus. Yeah. There we go. Mm -hmm. His beard has shading and highlights. His armor, his kilt, and, like, the little, like, awards and things on the side. See that? Now, he's a little bit shiny because he was my first experimenting using, uh, like, a shiny oil. To paint him or to like uh, like a dry brush or a, a wash a shiny oil wash but i think it really came out nicely with his pants and stuff mm -hmm. and again like the buckles and things and like his quiver is a different color his the leather his leather strap isn't bad i'm just really pleased with how like he came out he was like the fourth or fifth miniature i painted around that so i'm, I'm really happy with how he came out he's a nice guy Got his sword. Mm -hmm. Then mm -hmm. I have my little uh what are they called? The little raven people? Kenku, I think. <clears throat> Is it George, do you remember what the Raven people are called in D D? Uh yeah, they're the Kenku. Kenku. So we got our little samurai guy. I like the little the little the gray streak for his eyebrow. And again, he he's these ones are even smaller. Been like the average dude, so he was even harder to paint. He took a lot of fine detail. Hey, sussy! <laughs> they are very pink. Welcome on in. You missed it. We built, um... We built an at-at. Funny little at-at. And we built a tauntaun. With some guy named Luke on him. But the Tauntaun's a Jedi, because he's got a, a discharged lightsaber right here. So we built the Jedi Tauntaun and some guy. And I thought that they came out nice. The tail wiggles. Yes! Oh, yes! The Porb. Now in mouse pad. I love the Porb. We all love the Porb. We got a Porb pad. You 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 gotta you gotta make a porb where the eyes are a bit closer together and make a boob mouth pad, but it's porb. Here's the thing, Ash and I have been desperately trying to figure out how to do how to do uh, wrist pads like this one. Yeah. 
lot with Booba. And mm, it, yeah. like, because we can sublimate on the material now, on the blanks and things, and nobody sells like it. Sublimating, you have to press flat with the paper. And so we think that what they're doing is that they're printing it first and then putting the thing on afterwards. And like that technology is in one factory Thanks somewhere in Taiwan. I use my poor pen to help me cook eggs. I'm so glad that you do. <laughs> oh, by the way, all the physical prizes for the subathon have been mailed out. So I believe Mayans, right. you're getting the coin. Uh, I believe Buttercup Bandito, or was it? Um, or was it? Anyway, there was the porb, the coin, and the plate. They've all been mailed out. I forget exactly who got what. Ooh. So there we go. All right. I. <laughs> That's a bounce. If Nekula it's... wants, we can give. Like, if Nekula actually wants to get a cut, we commissioned him for the art. So, if Nekula, we, we, I'd have to talk to Nekula about it, but I wouldn't be opposed to it at all. Nekula made the porb, and I love the porb. Yes. Yeah, so let me continue with the money. Kenku. So I was just, um, just saying, I'm, I'm going to bounce now because it's like one forty-five a.m. Oh gosh, that's right. It's very late in the UK. You have a good night, Kirkman. Then we're going to finish night, up Kirkman. showing off some miniatures. Everyone. Bye everyone on goodbye. stream. See you later. Good, goodbye. 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 Come on, focus. I'm fading away. Where is this blooming Discord button? There it is. <laughs> I've done it many times, Garrick. It's fine. Come on, focus, I'm you little goober. Really fading away this time. Ooh. There we go. There we go. See, he's got even his eyes are colored. That was very tricky to just get the eye. There we go. Now that he's actually in focus, you can see that he's got a lot of color details. Right down to his painted toe talons. Then we have the wizard Kenku. These colors were not as bright as I would have originally liked, but I like how his cloak came out with you know being shaded and tattered. I really like how like how I like how like their little I gave them little red talons. Like they paint their nails to match his cloak. And then we have the archer swordsman one. Okay, I have to get going. Okay, I'll see you later, Shark Thank you very much for having me. You have a good night as well. Thank you very much for dropping in. Have a great like night. I, oh, yeah. yeah and remember, night. like I said, Thank when you I... for having me. Oh, absolutely. When I tell people that, like, I generally have an open guesting policy, that when I'm streaming, if you just want to pop in to guest... You're more people are more than welcome. If I've streamed with you before, if you've guested with you before, you're more than welcome to just mention it. Like everybody who's on screen tonight, except Mental, was like, "Hey, can we drop in?" And I'm like, "Sure, of course." Um, I'm just, I, I'm just I naturally hope nervous I'll... about stuff like that. Smoosh. I hope I'll be able to join back soon. Yeah, Sometime. I would love to have you in. You're really have fun. Have a good one now. Bye bye. And again, I like how I was able to do like the little tiny details, like the hilt. Okay. His his cloak pin, his eyebrows, his little blue eyes. I'm really happy with how he came out. He's a nice little guy. I like him. And there we go. And these are ones that I have yet to paint because I'm looking at this guy and going, oh, fuck my life, no. He's got so many little surfaces. He is a nightmare. <clears throat> yeah, like, I don't want to even try. I it think that's above my level. Yeah, I'm like I'm looking at him like he's above my level. She's more on my level. I could probably I do her painting. I am very hungry, Pink. Okay, yeah, sure. All right, let me get everything put away. All right, so I thank everybody for coming in today. Thank you for everybody who guested with me. I really appreciate it. Uh, if you want, put in feedback section in the Discord, which I'm linking right now. If you'd like more LEGO streams, I'd like to hear about it. We'll definitely do more LEGO streams in the future. And if you'd like maybe miniature painting streams, we can give that a try as well. So it'll probably take us a couple sessions to paint a miniature. There we go. Uh, uh, Pink. Yeah. I think I just want, just want to say uh, thank you for letting me like uh, get the first time. It was uh, <laughs> it was fun. Of course. And. Uh, also, just want to say I'm thankful that I came across you over Aww. like sub earlier this year for being like a recommendation of friend 
recommend the Aww. recommend me your streams. That is yeah. the most powerful it's advertising that there is. Is word of mouth with friends and stuff. You can't yeah, beat that. Yeah. Yeah. If, if a friend of it mine is... says, hey, you should watch this person, I will absolutely stop what I'm doing and go watch them because a recommendation from a friend is super good. Mm. So I you appreciate have been you, very, You have been very instrumental to me about on on me and helping me with my stuff, and I Aww. just want to say thank you, Pink, and I'm very happy, happy and uh, congratulations for all your success. Thank you. <laughs> Um, thank you very much for being here, madam. Thank you, thank you very, very much. It's great. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, let me go ahead and pop over to the ending screen. And stick around. Please stay in your seats. We are going to do a raid. So give me just a minute. Ending scene. There we go. Oh, no. Everybody's in bed. I'll have amazing taste and I oh, respect no. it. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, George is on top of a tofu. Ah. <laughs> uh so thank you everybody who subbed today. Remember, all over Twitch right now, if you get a new sub on the channel, or if you give a gift sub, they are 25% off. If you spend at least 300 bits, oh no, the tub. If you spend at least 300 bits, the streamer gets an extra 30 bits. So that's pretty cool as well. <laughs> Everybody's doing all my redeems at the end. So thank you very much for being here. Demi, thank you for the raid, BB. And uh, Everybody else, thank you very much for the raids. I really appreciate them. Thank you to everybody who subbed today. Everybody who followed. Jail for EP. All right, I'm going to let Chat Squid do a little message, and then we are going to go ahead and do a raid. Hey, you. Don't go just yet. Stay for the raid, or else. Thank you for watching today. We really appreciate it. Thank you to everyone who followed, subscribed, or donated via the Ko-Fi. Oh, did you know we have a Ko-Fi? We do. And it really helps if you use that double support via Ko-Fi with the same $5. Supporting us via Ko-Fi makes your dollars go further. Also, remember, if they say you don't need a union, we're like family. Jeez. We 100% need Jeez. a union. A, C, A, B, bye bye. All right, I do believe I have found us a target. We are going to be raiding Squid Punk tonight. Squid Punk is playing Metal Hellsinger. Which, if I recall correctly, is a rhythm doom game. Boop. So I think we will all enjoy that. We need a raid message. George, what's our raid message tonight? Tauntaun Jedi, maybe? I don't know. Things are uh -oh. good for me, George. <clears throat> Here we go. Mm. <laughs> they kissed and they were both boys. They kissed and they were both boys. Is Yeah, no, that's, that's a good that's one. Because I made the Tauntaun and the at, at kiss and they were both boys. <laughs> they kissed and they were both boys is now our raid message for the night. Thank you. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Thank you everyone for being here. I really appreciate it. Uh, you guys made this stream a success. Legos pulled in the good, good numbers, and we are definitely going to be streaming more Lego stuff in the future. We've got an X-Wing to put together, an A-10 Warthog, and uh, a little farmhouse with a cat and a dog and a little tractor that we're going to put together in the future too. So we got lots of Lego ahead of us. I hope you all had a good night. I had a great time with all my guests. Thank you very much, George. Uh, I'm sad that I'm going to be missing out on you, Iggy, and Lexi to Lexi Chu tomorrow on Iggy Maid's channel. You'll be playing with Greb, Lexi, and you in Valheim tomorrow. I will Normally, be I join with in. me. Yes. <laughs> That's true. Yes. All right. You all have a good night. Check out Iggy's channel tomorrow uh, for some Valheim. I will be back there again in the following week on Thursday. I'll see you all later. You have a good night and bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.